Hi everyone, Yvette here, and I just wanted to share three more wedding photos, photo albums that I have here. These are three uh, Mr. Benjamin tutorials that I used um, from Kathy King from Paper Phenomenon. And what I did is I made the shells uh, in black cardstock and then I gave the three albums to my daughter-in-law for a gift and she is the one that matted them and put her photos in. So I will share that with you because she has done a wonderful job. And um, she has like kind of volume one, two, and three. Book one has 195 photos in it. Book two has 140. And book three has 214. All the spines are three inches. And they measure nine and three quarters by seven and a half. And um, on the cover, she wrote, From this day forward, you shall not walk alone. On book two, she wrote, My arms will be your shelter, and my heart will be your home. And this is something she had painted on a sign um, above the barn doors when you went down to the, um, to the front where they got married. So I will show you one book at a time, and um, I hope you enjoy them. There's a lot of photos, and um, they're wonderful ideas on how to to decorate your own books with photos. And I just finished posting my video um, with the one I made. And I just wanted to point out that we have, we both um, put all our photos in first and then we went and matted the albums. So that's how we did it. So anyways, Karen's paper line was mainly this one. She used a vintage country from Recollections. This is an older paper collection, I think. And... Um, the spine we covered with the canvas that was in this this paper sash, so um, that's what she used for that. Um, we also ended up using this one from Paper House, and it's to have and to hold, and this is definitely an older paper line. Um, I can't remember exactly how old it is, but um, yeah, it's it's a really good paper line. We also used a few sheets from Simple Stories, The Story of Us. We used some of this recollection here, and this one's called Bridal Bliss. Again, I'm not sure how old these paper collections are because we had them for a while. We did use some of this one, which is... Um, craft smith and it's just a love story lots of gold and um, stuff from that one we used some of this one dcw and this one is for the formal affairs and we might have used some of this one from Mombi sheets and it's a true love story never ends so might have used this one too from my big ideas. So anyways, those are some of the, the paper collections we used. And this is your <clears throat> canvas. This was um, a label that she had, Mr. and Mrs. Clay's on the 1st of October, 2016. And I added one of these Tim Holtz um, little knobby things. And uh, if she wants, she can hang a charm on there when she when she has more time. So let's start. So on the inside we have a poli policy envelope um, and here we have the two by the three by fours, some journaling cards and some photos. I think I better zoom out a bit here. And then we have the rings up on top. And then the bottom, these are some thank you cards that she wrote to myself and my husband and then her mom and dad. Here's the program. So 
So yeah, this album has, there's their initials carved in a tree. So this album has 195 photos. Again, like I say, we ended up matting. Um, we ended up putting the photos in first and then matting. So this was my son getting ready. Let's just center that a bit more. There you go. And here she took a picture of the napkin or the handkerchief. And there's the pocket page. We used a border punch here. I was putting his ear on. Makeup for her. And then the girls. And these are all two by threes. Got a bit of a glare going on there. Let's see if I turn the light off if it will help. journaling cards. It was a fall wedding, October 1st, and it was just beautiful weather. Here's some two by threes that she cut down and then two by threes here. Nice little collage. Another little photo there, used as a sticker. She did a really good job displaying her photos. Everything looks really, really nice. Some two by th or three by threes here. She wrote little messages on the back of the ties. her wedding party, the girls. I like how this, how she did that. And these are probably four by fours. Four by six up here and then four two by threes. Another little picture of the handkerchief and then she used it as an embellishment. And here she cut the four by sixes a bit. Or the, yeah, the, the four by sixes, yeah. This is decorations on a palette. They had blankets just in case it was cold out. This is the yard. They got these old barn doors, and here's that sign that I that I read in front of the in front of the books, the messages. That's that sign there. This is an old lantern that was put in the middle of the gazebo. This belonged to my dad. They had bales. And then church benches in the front. There's the sign that she had above the barn doors. And that's what she used for the title of her books. And the flower vases. The decorations were unbelievable. And then we had a champagne reception in the back in a tent. Where they served some coffee, cookies, and some champagne. Again, this is, he's saying a prayer to Taryn before the ceremony, and there she photocopied that and put it on the page. There, we're starting to enter. And there 
after she cut down the four by six and then added a, some two by threes, four by, or three by fours. Another pocket page. There's my son waiting in the front and here she's coming down the aisle. Two four by sixes that she cut down. Three by four or two by three or three by fours, yeah. Four by sixes. There she cut a big photo down to almost a six six by six almost. And then another some gold sheets. And that's a large picture of the ceremonies. A kiss. And these are almost four by our six by six is two. Two by or three by fours. And then this is the back. We have a picture there, and then a four by six journaling card, and then we have Mr. And Mrs. Just Married, and here she wrote the reading that Jeremy read, and then some more photos. And then we're walking out. her parents here and then us. So that is book number one. I will start a new video for the second one. There's the back. And again, there's the, I'll zoom out a little bit here. Yeah, it looks really nice. You did a really good job, and I will show you part two. Thanks for watching. Bye.